In this video, I'm going to show you the elements of security I've added to protect myself and my belongings from an intruder. Feeling safe and protecting a huge investment like this while traveling to new areas, in my opinion, is the hardest part of transitioning to van life. But I think if done correctly, safety and security can definitely be achieved. My first line of defense is the Thule van lock. I installed one of these on the sliding and passenger door and another one on the rear doors. Basically, it fuses the doors together, making popping the lock and opening the door not an option. Thule sells these as singles or sets where both pieces can be unlocked by the same key. I love these. I think they're very user friendly and just seeing them I feel like could be a deterrent to somebody. For the driver's door, I decided to drill this marine fixture I found at a home improvement store to the inside so I could then link a padlock, chain, and the steering wheel all together. This now prevents the door from opening if the vehicle were to be unlocked and it's another element of visible security. So for me to lock all the doors, I secure the driver's door first and then I leave through the passenger or sliding door, locking that last on the way out. This leaves a van only accessible through one of the windows. This is why I purchased a van with no cargo windows as I wanted to keep everything private and if I really crave sunshine or fresh air, I would just go outside or open the sliding door. That being said, I've also posted these surveillance stickers on the windows and have a security camera inside. I have this device linked to a mobile hotspot which allows me to get a notification if it detects motion, I can sound an alarm, and live stream what's happening in the van. Something I didn't plan for but it's been very helpful are the fisheye mirrors on the side of the van. If I hear anything weird outside, I can peek over the blackout curtain without moving it and drawing attention to kind of scope out the area. If someone were to make it all the way into the van and have all the time in the world, I guess at that point I just hope all the good stuff is hard to find. A unique feature I built into the van is allowing access to the space under the cabinets which is typically only lifted for a toe kick. This is cool just as a storage function but I think it's one of the last places that I would look if I were on a treasure hunt myself. I hope these examples of what I use are helpful and I've linked the products I've described in the description of the video. If you've enjoyed this style of video, let me know by liking and subscribe to my channel to keep watching other videos similar to this one. Thank you for watching.